welcome to day one of Disney Magic. We are heading to the parks now. It's Magic Kingdom day because where else are you going to go on the first day? Um, mm. That way. <laughs> We've just ordered an Uber because we're not actually heading straight to Magic Kingdom. We are going to the Grand Floridian for breakfast at the Grand Floridian Cafe, but we're just walking through the hotel now. So we are in the um, country section, which is the furthest away section from the lobby, but it's fine. It's nice being able to kind of walk through. To, it's nice being able to walk through the um, hotel first thing in the morning. It's really quiet around here other than the person vacuuming leaves. Um, it's really quiet today. It's lovely. Weather's nice as well. It's just nice and cool. We're heading to the bus stop now. I absolutely love the Broadway section. I studied drama at uni. So this is like my thing. So I kind of wanted to stay in the Broadway section, but it doesn't matter. Um, to be fair, it's not actually that long of a walk from the country section to the bus stop, to be fair. I thought it'd be really long, but it's not too bad. Um, oh, it's six minutes. Yeah, six, seven minute walk. We are pacing it today because we have a reservation to get to and our Uber drive is three minutes away. So come along on our first Disney day. I can't wait. We've got Tron. Oh, well, I've got Tron because he won't do it. I've got Tron all booked for today. I've got Jingle Cruise booked for today already. We have purchased Genie Plus. So, see what we'll get up to. The gingerbread house is up. <laughs> it's Christmas. <laughs> to be fair, we don't have time to go see it now, but it smells of gingerbread. Oh, look how beautiful this hotel is. One day, one day. We are about 10 minutes late, but hopefully it'll be okay. First drink of the trip, pop juice. Oh. Pop juice just hits differently. Not in Disney until I'm drunk pop juice. The food has come. We've both got the same. Ben has got it without the sauce on the side. I've just got it really with the honey hot. sriracha sauce. Yeah, my plate's hot as well. Really? But look how cute that Mickey waffle is! I haven't actually got this before. I usually get the um, pancakes or just like the normal like, eggs benedict breakfast. Oh, okay, you want the best chicken or But Ben always raves about it and I've I had chicken and waffles from that other restaurant but not from here anyway. It sounds like everyone's from Hollywood Studios. I think it's my little 95 minutes. That's normally something you don't want to wait for. 15, 20 minutes. Me. We've got a challenge that Ben wants, ben wants me to do later. So Disney have given us a $100 gift voucher with our um, Reservation. So Ben's basically said we'll do like a little challenge to kind of see who gets the hundred pound gift voucher basically or hundred dollar gift voucher. So he's given me ten things that I've got to do in a two hour window. I haven't seen what the ten things are yet. Um, so we'll, we'll see how it goes. I've got no idea what they are or anything. But he's given me like a list of things that I've got to do in two hours. So we're gonna do that later. It's just like a little fun thing to do. Um, so stick around to see if I can do it. I guess. But um, I am defeated. So I've eaten probably oh, half of my breakfast and I'm stuffed. You're stuffed as well when you normally finish your food and he hasn't finished it either. So, so good. Like the honey sriracha sauce they can't make it. It's amazing. And they put the chicken in like just like bread flakes almost just to give it that really crispy crunch on the outside. But the chicken just melts in your mouth. It's amazing. Um, Grand Floridian Cafe is definitely one of our favourite restaurants to come to, especially for breakfast. It doesn't change too much between breakfast and lunch. Um, I'm not sure if they're open for dinner, but breakfast and lunch are both really, really good. But I'm here and have them because their food is chef's. So the gingerbread house in the Grand Floridian finished, finished construction yesterday. And it looks absolutely amazing like look at it look how pretty the detail is ridiculous like the fact that that's literally all gingerbread they literally work on this for like eight months out of the year so they'll be working on this in like April, May time to put it up and then they have like two months, <laughs> two, three months off and then start all over again for 
next year. It's absolutely crazy. But like, it's literally like a shop by the back. That is so nice. <clears throat> And look at the ground low ears as well. They're lounge fly. They're actually made by lounge fly to match. That, that is beautiful. See, when we're DVC members here, I can get that bag. Pretty at Christmas. Look, they're doing the trolley cart as well now. I haven't done that since before COVID, and it only started a couple of weeks ago. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at it. Look how big it is. That's so how you can't see the castle behind it, though. No, I know, but I'm, good. I'm happy about that. I just like, no. Nah, haven't cried yet. <laughs> Good morning, Main Street. Well, it's what a beautiful day it is here in the Magic Kingdom. Right? Okay, there it is. I think it's a beautiful day for the Dapper Dance to sing a song on the trolley. Good idea. That is very creepy, that's all that. It's the time. It's the fault. It's the fault. It's the fault. It's the fault. back here and get photos a bit later because we have a reservation 10 minutes ago for Jingle Cruise. I'm putting his knowledge to the test. Normally he just follows me around everywhere but I'm telling him he's got to take me to Jingle Cruise this time. Is that where you're going? You sure? Normally I feel like you just follow me around and don't really pay attention to where you're going so I'm putting, putting you to the test. I like that. Yeah, I like that. No, I haven't either. Yeah. Yeah, I like that one. He's got that white one, but I like that top one. We want to try and find the Disney 100 one. I'm sure it will be everywhere in like the Emporium and stuff. First ride of our holiday trip is very apt. Did I get you there? Because we're doing the Jingle Cruise. So from. Really Pretty much November 1st, November 1st or November 2nd, they changed Jungle Cruise to Jingle Cruise and they've literally got like an eye. I don't know if you can see it from that. So they put an eye over the U on Jungle and changed it to Jingle Cruise. You can have the drinks in line, just not on the boat. You got some time while you're on. They are making way into Humbug territory. We also close the office by being here in their call. They show something like this. Uh, you spot Humbugs. They're very territorial creatures. Shirt itching for no good reason at all. That's probably just the fleas. <laughs> not be done. <laughs> well, what it says, it'll turn you into the worst of Scrooges. Into the best of carolers. So let's try this out, shall we? I want a, a two, a, a three, a... Jingle cruise, jingle cruise, jingle all the way. Bobbing your head and loving the words doesn't count. <laughs> we have some scrooges on board, but I'm sure we'll fix that before we go over the waterfall. Out of five, what are you waiting, Jingle Cruise? Uh, uh, that experience probably a four, because the skipper wasn't the best. It was quite good. It was good. Well, it wasn't. Yeah, like he missed the. the Backside of water bit. Not missed it, he's still done it, but it just wasn't, it didn't hit. Um, but it was good. It was good to hear different jokes. I feel like the more you go on Jungle Cruise, you kind of start hearing a few of the same jokes quite a lot, obviously. Um, so it was really good to see other jokes and everything. Next ride. I'm nervous, but excited, ridiculously excited. 
we've got a light oh, yeah, yeah. tron. It was twenty dollars. Luckily, I'm the only one that does roller coasters because I don't think I would have been able to justify forty dollars for two of us to go on a roller coaster. Twenty is bad enough for just one person. Um, but yeah, we've got Tron Lightning Lane now. And then we're pretty much jumping back over to Haunted Mansion. And then we'll see where the rest of the day takes us. I'm excited for Tron. I will try and... They've got like a little basket thing in front of the bike. So I'll... <laughs> They've got like a little basket thing in front of the bike that I'll try and put the camera into. So you can see some of it, I guess. But you're not really going to be able to see anything. It's more like my reaction. How much I'm screaming. Um, Oh, but yeah, I'm excited. Nervous? I don't know why. When I go on new roller coasters, I get nervous until I know I like them. I get nervous. I was really nervous before I went on Guardians of the Galaxy as well, and I don't know why. But it's now one of, my, one of if not my favourite rides in all of Disney World. It's Tron time! I'm so excited. Five countries. Okay. Take a ride in a honey pot. Yeah. Find the cast member recruitment door. Okay. Get a picture of one of the fan five. Okay. All that two hours. That's that's my ten. Okay. Right. So that is my ten that I've got to do. Obviously, I can use his. Obviously, if something happens and we can't do one, I might let you off. Depends on what you're doing. If you're doing rubbish. Right. Okay. And my where does my time start? Your time will start. Now. Now, right, okay, let's go. Right, um first thing that I reckon we're gonna do, I feel like I've forgotten what they are already. Right, luckily we already have a uh, Pirates of the Caribbean Lightning Lane. What time was that booked for? That was for one o'clock. What's the time now? For 20 past two, uh, 20 past 12. 20 past 12, right, okay, so we've got 40 minutes to do that. So that's within the time, luckily, so that's good. Right, can we look to see how long 
is small world is we're right here that looks like a very long line right one castle right in the background right one castle there done that's the beast castle from me i guess that count yeah yeah that's that's yeah. right next right so the four castles are the beasts cinderella castle obviously the te Rapunzel's Tower and um, Little Mermaid. Yeah? They are my four castles. Okay, right. One down. Yeah. The bad thing with what he's done is he's done it as um, you've got to do three rides. It's a busy day now in Magic Kingdom, so. Yeah, right. So I know I've already videoed it, but that's my one castle. Second castle. Yeah? Right? Castle number three. Let's go from the three castle. One more castle in front. Yep, I just want to get this out of the way because then I haven't got to worry about it and go to and from those different places. The hidden Mickeys, I feel like it's going to be harder. I need to keep an eye out. I feel like I'm normally really good at like finding hidden Mickey, hidden Mickeys, but when it's a challenge, <laughs> it's bloody hard. <laughs> Castle number four. It's not a castle, but I get what four you mean castles. by that. Right, that is one done. There's got to be hidden Mickey's in it. Stuff like paintwork and stuff. Like one, two, three. Head, ear, ear. I just showed it. I'll give you one. Cool. <laughs> That's the easiest point ever. <laughs> That's definitely not a hidden Mickey, but we'll go with that. <laughs> Struggling with the hidden Mickey's. So you've got eat a Mickey shaped snack. Yeah, that's easy. I can get that drink whenever. It's a holiday drink. It's a holiday drink. I don't know where they are. Well, if they ever got one, a speciality drink. It's only in a certain, for, like, you have to physically go to a place to have this drink. Okay. Take a photo past the front centre of the castle. Take a trip to see 45 countries. Which we're doing. We've now got a fast pass for. Find the cast member. Is there any hidden Mickey's? It's always like hidden Mickey's in these kind of things. Thank you to get a photo pass. Crown Cinderella Castle, that's another one. One hidden Mickey. Hang on, wait till I zoom in. Oh, it's on this side as well. Right, there. One hidden Mickey down. He's massively nice in me because there's upside, I'm not going to zoom into all of them. There's upside down, no, true. There's upside down ones in the middle, but you've got one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I've just Man. found ten hidden Mickey's when I only meant to find five. Damn, good. Right. right. Hey, Mickey shape snack, drink. Cast member door. Where the hey, hell is the cast member door? Is it still here? Found it. Found it. Found it. Oh, bloody found it. There's people sitting in front of it, so I can't get a photo. But, cast member door. Done. Right, so he's replaced um, Pirates of the Caribbean one because that was down with find 10 golden statues. That should be an easy one. Well, it was a bit of a hard one, so I'll give you an easy one. Yeah, because I've got three rides, obviously, with how busy Magic Kingdom is today. Yeah, they all went to pop. A bit of a stupid one, really. So, no, the only ride one we're going to be able to do out of them. This morning, when we actually got here, it was dead, and I thought, oh, you smashed this. Again, there's going to be people taking photos with a lot of these um, golden statues, but Chip and Dale there, one. I could just do this in, how many did you say? Ten. I don't actually how many there is, and that's just ridiculous to have here. Well, could Fifty. Have Google. Fifty, but in different 50. parts. Fifty, oh. Two, three, Donald and Daisy. Here we go. Five and six. Seven. Done ten, and I ain't even got to leave. I ain't even got to leave. Do what you need to do. Eight. Again, there's people in front of these two, so I'm not going to go over there. But nine, ten, Mickey and Minnie. Done. That one done. Yep. Who are we going for now? My next one is the Foos Brew. I'm not sure where they're doing holiday drinks at the minute. I don't think they've come out. 
I know they're doing certain holiday snacks, but I don't think they're doing drinks yet. So, you said they're not doing holiday drinks, I can do a speciality drink, yeah? Yes. Right, so that is what I'm going to do. So, what I'm going to do is go to Gaston's Tavern mm. and have a Lafouille's Brew. Might also get some of them while there as well, because I'll really want one of them. Um, okay. Why not? Um, also, you said Mickey Show Snack, yeah? Yep. Can I just get my glass of green pig in one? That's a Mickey Shape Snack. Get what you like. Give us a Mickey Shape Snack. Mickey Shape Snack. We then got a fast pass for. Um, Hi. Small pass for? World. Small World. I've been, I've been quick though, we've only got an hour left. Yeah, we've got a fast pass for Small World now. And then you said you were going to try and get it. I can't, I've just looked. Can't get one. Oh. Then more work done. Look at that. Better hope this don't take long. I'm just not yet. I feel like this is cheating. I went and wanted to go to the toilet and now I'm waiting for him to come out. I feel like he's wasting my time. <laughs> In this competition, I mean. I'm waiting for him for about five minutes. So I feel like I should get an extra five minutes if I need to. Because, yeah. I don't know. Oh, look how cute he is. <laughs> Mickey shaped snack acquired. Been just putting a spot in my bag. Um, I know it's a bit of a cop out because it's the easiest Mickey shaped snack to buy, but it's a Mickey shaped snack. That's all he said. He wasn't specific, so it is the first Mickey shaped snack of the trip, and it is the classic. That's a job. <laughs> I should not be allowed chocolate things. Fume To be fair, we're going back to the resort after our festival fancy anyway, so I'll just change the top. We are now doing the second to last thing of my <laughs> challenge. Benza, getting on and getting off. I yeah, if you're right, right, anyway, we were outside. To be fair, I didn't know there were 45 countries represented on this ride. I did know that there were 27 languages represented on this ride. But I didn't know there was 45 countries, so I've actually learned something. How are you doing this? Go get a drink. Smashed it. Done at Small World, the most annoying cruise that sailed. Um, I like Small World, don't get me wrong, I do like Small World, but by the time you get to like the last room, I'm like, get me off. Last stop on my challenge, I'm now in Gaston's Tavern and I'm getting a Lafouze brew because this is the only place in Disney World that you can get this drink. So it is a specialty drink. So that was the last thing on my um, to do list and I have 18 minutes left. Last snack acquired, got the Lafouze brew and Gaston really does use antlers in all of his decorating. <laughs> it's cool because they've got like the dartboard up there and it's got. It's like LeFou and Gaston are playing each other and like you see like LeFou's score compared to Gaston, it's quite funny. And look at the darts, they're actually like in the top of the ball. So it's like darts up there. Yeah, we had to adapt it a fair bit because of you putting a lot of rides in, so we did have to adapt it, but I went with them adaptions and I still smashed it. Got a LeFou's brew, in all honesty, not a fan. She's so pretty. I know I am. <laughs> <laughs>
Kingdom for a little bit. We will be back this evening to watch Happily Ever After. It's Happily Ever After today and I'm very excited about it. Um, <laughs> um, purchases were made. Yeah. You got stuff nice. as well. Yeah, three things. Yeah, you still got stuff. Exactly. Our three things come to life. I got about four nine things. Pounds. So. Not my problem. Come on, and 240 quid later. Anyway. Um. Now getting the bus back to the hotel. And it's never been on the before. first Disney <laughs> bus of the trip. Yeah. Which is exciting! Never, never been to that hotel before. We've so never been to this hotel on a bus before. <laughs> we'll have a look on the map. Yeah, we're just heading back to the hotel for an hour or two. One, to chill out for a little bit. Two, because I need to not have a chocolate uh, top on. We're back at the hotel. Just had something to eat. A quick freshen up. I've changed my top. You've got like air hockey table, Pac Man, loads of like the basketball thing over there. Doodle jump, absolutely loads of stuff. It's wicked. And then just across the hall, so you pull and everything's out there. And then this is your lobby. And your lobby, your food court. Just looks like this. There's loads more seating back there as well. When you come down here, you've got your front desk there. You've got like a little kids area over there for when people are watching. Films and then shop through here. We've actually got loads of stuff in here as well. We've got hundred stuff. I really like this lounge flyer. It's for the hundred, obviously. It's so cute. And that one. I've actually got like a really good selection in here as well, to be fair. And I haven't actually seen that one in any of the shops either. We've got a selection of spirit jerseys as well. Kids' clothes, bags. Over here is over there. Pins. That is a very cute pin. I love that. So it is a fair bit later now, as you can probably tell from the sky. We are back in Magic Kingdom. Um, we are sitting in Main, in Main Street <laughs> in the hub. And we've got about an hour until fireworks. I'm trying to kind of keep myself calm. <laughs> freaking out a little bit. I'm just so excited. I've been waiting four years to see this show and tonight is finally tonight and I've only got an hour left to wait and I literally can't wait. I'm going to be crying a million of one tears. I'm not going to film the show because you've probably seen it already or you can Google it and YouTube it or whatever. So I'm not going to film it. I literally just want to enjoy it. The fact that I'm seeing it for the first time, I just want to enjoy it as much as I possibly can. And I will see you after. I promise you I will not look like this after. <laughs> I'll have any eyelashes left. I'll have black eyes running down here. Yeah. Um, <laughs> God. But yeah, I'm just, I'm so excited. Um, and it just looks so pretty at this time of night. Like, the castle's all lit up. It's starting to get dark. It is just stunning. So excited. I will see you after the show. Well, I'm not okay. <laughs> oh, that was so good. I look absolutely horrendous. Um, yeah. I was unwell during that, shall we say. I cried before it even started. Well, just before it started. While the whole Happily Ever After first bit was on. And then I was okay until Go The Distance started. The second I heard that song, I freaked out. Oh no, actually ignore that. I cried a tiny bit during and You'll Be In My Heart as well because Tar that's Tarzan, that's mine and Ben's song. And that was really cute. So I cried a little bit during that. <laughs> and then I cried a hell of a lot from Go The Distance to the end, basically. Um, and I was an absolute mess <laughs> by the end of it. As you can tell, it was so much better in person. Seeing it on a screen on a TV in our room for four years <laughs> doesn't do it justice like that made me cry as it is but seeing it actually in person was just unbelievable and now I'm a mess <laughs> and we're trying to kind of do a few rides while we're here we paid for Genie Plus today and we haven't done loads of rides we've done like four or five um, 
so we just want to kind of make the most of Judy Fuzz basically. So we've got to try and kind of ping pong around the park a little bit and do the rides that we haven't done yet, or some of the rides we haven't done yet. Um, and I'll obviously bring you along, so excuse the absolute mess of me like the puffy eyes the clumpy eyelashes and just red mess but um yeah <laughs> it was amazing it was better than i even thought it was gonna be i hyped it up so much in my head that i was kind of expecting it i don't know i was expecting it to be amazing but i hyped it up so much in my head that i was slightly worrying that it wasn't going to live up to my expectations but it lived up to my expectations and then some it's just so good and you notice so many things seeing it in person that you don't see on a screen like certain fireworks and certain projections and different little bits i was like oh i've never seen that before just a bit <laughs> a bit much to be honest <laughs> i'm not well um, there was other people around me crying, but I just looked like an absolute nutter, like blubbering mess. I know other people will get what, like get me, so it doesn't really bother me, I don't care. I look like an absolute nutter, but <laughs> everyone can look at me weird. Okay, go ahead. I've got Lightning Lane for Little Mermaid now, um, and then I don't know what we're going to do. We'll do a couple of rides, even if we just stay here for an hour, because the park is still very, very busy. Um, so even if we just stay here for another hour, that's fine. Um, but we're just kind of try and get as many rides as we can done. So stick around to see what we get up to, I guess. We are tired. He'll never reach that tree. Mommy, mommy, oh dear! Hang on tightly, Ru. Look, Mama, look! I'm a It's been such a good day. I feel like we've done so I much as well. Just because the morning we had, it was a bit, it was a bit of a busy morning. We got, got it done like three rides. Yeah. And then went and get lunch, then come back. It was an important, then come out and watch a parade, and then it sort of chilled right. There. Yeah. What was your favourite part? What was the day? Yeah. Probably our favourite part. Probably. I feel like if you saw my reaction earlier, which if you've got this far in the vlog, you see my reaction earlier. So I don't really need to say, need to say what my favourite part was today. I rambled on about it ages, um, for ages a minute ago, but that show just it's different. It's just unreal. I've done a few rides, obviously, once the fireworks finished as well. It's definitely calmed down here now. It's, but it's still quite busy. Like there's still people everywhere. I mean, what we haven't done is done uh, uh, pirates, but that's been down all day. Yeah, pirates been down all day. We had a lightning lane for it earlier, and it's been down all day. So we redeemed it with small world lightning lane. Um, I was quite impressed with myself that time. My little challenge that you sent me earlier. So yes, yeah, she did. So we picked hundred dollars for me. Thank you very much. I've spent it already. So <laughs> yeah, I've spent that and then some already. Um, but thank you so much for watching. I think today's probably going to be quite a long vlog. Um, 
travel day and first days are normally my longest vlogs that I do. Um, yeah, I will try and be good for the rest of the series of actually picking up the camera. I'm usually absolutely useless at it, but I will. Pro I promise I will try. Um, I enjoy watching them back. That's the main reason why I do it. So I'll try. I promise. Um, but yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Tomorrow we are going to Animal Kingdom in the morning and Hollywood Studios in the evening. We are watching Fantasmic, which you like that show, don't you? Um, I love it again. I cry. Shock. Um, <laughs> so yeah, keep an eye out for that. It will be up within the next week or so. But keep an eye out for that. Thank you all guys so much for watching and I'll hopefully see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.